663, I'm behind a uh, stolen vehicle. All right, we're gonna be uh, westbound on uh, M. Uh, 2018 uh, GMC Sierra. Speeds are about 80. He's uh, getting pretty far ahead of me now. Still westbound on M. Uh, the speeds are uh, around 110. Uh, no traffic. Six sixty three. I believe I've lost him westbound on Old uh, Limey Road. I believe that road goes to a low water bridge. Can you double check that? It comes out to Wilson's Road after it crosses the slab. It may be too high to cross. Okay, we're not going to be able to uh, cross this through the waters. 612 Green, check my AVL. I've got the vehicle. Units come to me. Right now, we're going to where the vehicle was located, and we don't have a driver in custody as of right now. Hopefully, we can find him on thermal because there's not a lot of places out here he can go. He's going to be bedded down in a field. Quick. By the look of it, he crossed the low water crossing back here and just ran off the road, crashed out. Hey, has anybody walked down this trail? Okay, there's a there's a shoe print right here. You got left, I got right. It, don't, it doesn't look like there's no way they can shut these back without there's cobwebs on them still. Hands up Ooh. now! Get your hands up! Hey, watch that dog! Watch that dog! Somebody watch the taser! Hey, pull that! Pull your hands around! Can I just stand up with my dog? Hey, keep your keep your hand up so we can see your hand. I get that you're trying to grab your dog, but can you tie that leash to that tree? Somebody grab that leash through there. What happened tonight, man? I was sleeping in the bushes. Y'all come walk out. Do you want to run him real quick for me? You were sleeping in the bushes. Why are you all... Why are you all wet and... Go ahead. Wash my hair in the creek. We walked up, found him, laid down in uh, some high weeds with his dog. We were able to take him into custody with, uh, out further incident. And then he uh, decided that he was out here camping. That's why he was out in the woods. But he's going to be charged with uh, tampering with a motor vehicle and then resisting arrest by fleeing. And then he also had some warrants for his arrest as well. It's going to be a shot put through this fling. She's a white female. She's apparently naked now, running down Allen Street. We're heading to a business holdup alarm. Apparently it's a female shoplifter that's uh, fleeing the scene, is now naked. So. Where's she at? There's a gray Impala she I was driving. Her. There's her clothes she in her purse. There's a gray Impala. The, the, the car went the down right. she ran that way. She ain't got no clothes on. Right here on Hall and Phillips and Pike, she just ran into the building. She's parked the building. All right, so she's ran into a business over here. 
Uh, we should be seeing her any second now. I'm trying to get better directions from our officer on scene. Where are you at? I'm on haul on Pendleton Pike. Mechanic shop. She's in the building somewhere. I just seen her come in here. All right, so apparently she's ran into this business here and uh, she's just trapped inside. Car two and car four is on site at Corrine. Go around to the run. Which way? Uh, I don't know. I hey, get back to the east. They thought they saw her, so I ran to the west, and they said she's running eastbound through the building. So get a car over there on the outside to the east. 4031. I'm over here by the detail okay. shop. It's on the far west side, northwest side of the building. Okay, yeah, that should be good. Are you able to see pretty much uh, the entire back side of this place? Where at, sir? Brian. Where's the bag? Where, where, where you're working at? Right here. To the, to the left? Yeah. Better get out and show me your hands. Get your hands up where I can see them. Step out. Step out. Turn away from me. I'm taking her into custody. Why don't you clear if we can go ahead and release that parameter we had on the outside? They get everything back? Yeah, they got everything back. They got her dress over there too. Because she when he grabbed her, she came right she ran out, out of her clothes. Yeah. So, so what all she take? A drill. Okay. You guys want to prosecute? She's got a warrant for theft. The business that she tried to steal a power tool from today wants to prosecute. So she's going to have an additional charge for that. So today she's going to go to jail for the warrant and then for uh, additional theft. That's going to be 10-4. The suspect is at location one between those two vehicles. 26. So right, right now we're headed to a location where there is uh, an individual that ran from Newport Beach okay. Police Department. Basically, a motorcycle, they attempted a traffic stop on them. They ended up not refusing to stop. We're going to try to get into that area, see if we can get him before he tries to run. But he ditched the motorcycle somewhere, and he's out on foot. Put your hands up now. Put your hands in the air. Put your hands in the air. Stand up. Stand up. Put your hands in the air and stand up. Face, face the door. Face that door. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Don't move. I'm not moving. <clears throat> What's going on? What are you doing here? Was on the phone? Yeah. Do you live here? No. Then why are you hiding on the ground? I wasn't hiding on the ground. I was sitting on the phone. Ouch, why are you hurting me? You're being detained right now is what's going on. Yes, sir. Okay, but why are you hurting me? I'm not hurting you. Well, what you have I anything do? on you? No, what did I do wrong, sir? Well, first of all, you're hiding behind a car that you don't live in this area. I wasn't Isn't that hiding. a little suspicious? I wasn't hiding. I was sitting down. That looks more like hiding. Get back, ma'am. Get back. Stay over there. Yeah, stay okay. back. I was arguing with my girlfriend, and she came to pick me up now. Yeah? yeah? Okay. We'll figure that out. Okay. What did I do wrong? What's your address, Can you grab his stuff? Yeah. Hey, what's going on? What's up? Babe, I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Babe. Well, I'll put them out here for you. Ba hey, babe, can you get my property? Hey, come here. Can you get my property? We'll talk in a second. Yes, sir. Right here. You yes, have anything sir. else on you? No, sir. I don't have anything. All right. This guy right here, he, he's, got, got, he's got some questions listen, for you. Listen, man. Yes, sir. Just listen to me for a I second. Wanna, All right. I don't want to start. Just no problems. Okay. You, there's no problems right now. Yes, but sir. At the very least, you're sitting in between a house that you're not supposed to be at. 
right? That's called loitering and prowling. I'll explain that to you in a minute. Yes, sir. The reason you're there, you made a boo-boo, right? On the phone we, with my no, no, no. It wasn't. You were on the phone arguing yes, with your girlfriend. Do you own a motorcycle? Yes, sir. You don't own a motorcycle. So we're not going to find a motorcycle anywhere in this neighborhood. I'm sure you find ten of them. Okay. I don't know. Okay. Then why are you hiding in between two cars? I why wasn't are you hiding. I was sitting on the ground. I was arguing with my wife. Why are you sweating? You don't sweat from arguing with your wife. You sweat from running from the police. We got the motorcycle. Yeah, that bike. What motorcycle? Uh, hey, it's just south. It's south of our location right here. That's just behind the house. Behind the house. Yep. You ran from the cops. It happens. People do that. All right, but to play stupid as an adult and you want to play ignorant, that's just that's just silly, man. There is no question whether or not you did it. That's exactly the, you're wearing the same exact clothes. It's easier to cooperate than to just sit there and play ignorant. Because playing dumb, like you're catching yourself on your tongue here. You're not even talking. I, mean, I guess I was sitting on someone's driveway. Uh, so why is your motorcycle in the backyard? I don't own a motorcycle. I know. I'm not saying you own it. I don't know if there's a motorcycle in that backyard. Listen, we had a person who watched you hide from there. You don't just stand in somebody's driveway, hit and crouch down, talking to your girlfriend who doesn't I'm live in the on area. My butt, actually. Okay, so you live off of. No, where do you live off of? And I'm pretty sure it's not going to be a road in this area that I know. Okay. I don't want to argue with you. It's fine. All right. Well, just so you're aware, yes, right now you are going to be arrested for loitering and prowling, for yes, sure. Sir. Basically, he's in an area that a normal citizen wouldn't be at odd hours at the time. He obviously doesn't live in this neighborhood, and he's hiding behind a vehicle for obviously co contacting his wife, hoping that she would have came and picked him up before we got here. These guys were walking down the middle of the street. Six oh seven. Six oh seven. I have a, a foot pursuit going uh, west on first by Catholic War Veterans Correction Second. There's uh, three subjects. It's gonna be a. Uh, Black over blue and beige over blue. Why'd you run, man? Stupid. Mm. Why'd you run, man? Because you're drinking? No. Why? Yeah, we don't hear something or what? Yes, sir. There's also about three more that ran. 545. Running westbound. It's gonna be black over blue, black shirt over blue, and then a beige sweater over blue. We got him. Good, you good? Yes. Relax, relax, relax. Relax. Why are we all hiding in the in the porter party, man? Are they scary? You know what they've been doing, cops nowadays? No, I don't know. They've been shooting people nowadays. <laughs> While searching the general area, one of our other officers heard something in the porter party area. So when he went over to check on it. Uh, turns out the two that ran away from Officer Oliva were hiding in there. Is this bad for me? Is Why is it bad for you? Are you on probation or something? Yeah. For what? Uh, um, robbery. Autogree robbery. Robbery? Autogree robbery. Uh, 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 what? Autogree robbery. Aggravated? Yeah. OK. George, Victor, Victor. Hey, we brought these guys in because they, they ran from you, right? Yeah, we caught them both. For real? You swear to God, dude. We're at. They were in the partner potty. I heard it out. For real? This is one of them. This is one of them, right? Yeah, I just go from them. Oh, yeah. Why'd you run? 
I ran to the app. Where are your other buddies? Where are the other guys? The other guy, uh, what's his name, brought him in. He found uh, him. Bait Twitter? Yeah, yeah. He's over there. Yeah. These were the only guys that ran. The other ones stopped right away. Well, we, no, we, we cut we cut two. Yeah, after a while. No, I stopped. The other guys ran. I they stopped. Kept, they kept running. You stopped, though. You I were... stopped, you see? But like, you did I... run, though. No, I, yeah, but I stopped. <laughs> but you did run. Doesn't mean you yeah. ran. 67 has the other one. He's jumping them off. All right. Turns out they ran because one of them's wanted for aggravated robbery. He's on probation for that. And the other individual's also wanted for um, evading arrest in a motor vehicle. So they took off running, just made it worse for themselves. They'll be charged with evading arrest on foot and then have to deal with the consequences of violating probation or parole or whatever they're on. I'm just going to do a quick uh, attempt to locate on the subject. Uh, He's got an evading with a vehicle charge and also a harassment charge. Two uh, criminal warrants. I heard a male's voice that way. Hello, ma'am. I'm looking for Christopher. Yes, is he here? Okay. Do you mind if I follow you? Is it okay? I don't know. No, I think you better not come in. Who's the male that came to the door in him? Mm. Can I go in your house? I need to look for him, okay? I know he didn't go, he has no shirt on. Is it okay if I go in your house? Where is he at? Okay, is there any guns in the house? Okay, can you sit right here, please? Christopher, El Paso Police. Where you at? Christopher, where you at? Where are you? How you doing, sir? Where's Christopher? You're you're not the male I saw at the door. Is Christopher in the in the den or in his room? He's in the house. I saw him right now. I know he's your son. You don't want nothing bad to happen to him. Call him down here, man. We need to speak to him now. Call down to him, please. I right, can hear you moving around up there, Christopher. I'm not playing around. Come down. Chris. Chris, you need to come down, son. They need to talk to you. You need to come, son. They're not going to leave until they talk to you, mijo. Yo, where'd he go? Back, 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 back. I'm gonna check the roof real quick. Hey guys, she's saying that uh, he went back in the attic that she saw him. Oh, he's right there. Is he? Yeah, Christopher, I see you. Get your ass over here now. Christopher, come back this way. I got him upstairs. I'm not messing with you, man. Get over here. You guys don't need to hurt me, all right? Come all right. out slow with your hands up. I will, man, I will. I'm coming, man. I'm not gonna try to do nothing stupid, man, I promise. Well, you already ran once. It's kinda hard to believe you right now. Sit down and lay down. Please lay on the ground, me, lay on the ground. Please lay on the ground, lay on the ground. Please don't hurt me, man. Turn around, turn around. Please don't hurt me, man. I don't got nothing to... I know, I know. Let me... Put your hand behind your back. I'm okay, I will, man. I know, I know man, I know. Okay, guys, I ain't got nothing. I promise. There's a lot of clutter up in that attic, but I saw a little movement. It turned out to be him, luckily. Uh, that way I didn't have to go in there, but uh, it was him. He came out, and um, he's doing okay. Here, Good ass. Remember last time you were singing in the car? Hey, man, I remember you. <laughs> you were singing in the back seat, remember? I'll put, I'll put some music off for you. Yeah, we're going to play it. Can you put it on again? He's going to be arrested tonight on his two warrants that he had, and uh, he's going to be picking up a third charge of evading. You guys are badass. I admire you guys. I appreciate that. Too. You want to have some? 
Mr. Sergeant, he's not badass. The rose is red and my Katie is too. Well, my heart is empty and my love is blue. We had a uh, OHP trooper that got into a pursuit at this, into this academy sports right here, and the uh, vehicle got abandoned. They took off running under the wood line. Uh, it looks like we had the suspects running around the east side of the building. The other half was running west around the building, and just kind of scattered from there into the wood line. Our helicopter's in the air. They're circling the area, and they've got somebody that's crawling through some brush over here on the northwest. Yeah, I want to corner. Four, three. You with me? 10 4 we're walking down. If we kind of got us in. I hear him right here. He's like right there. I can hear him. Tell us the police. We know you're there. Walk to me right now. Come to the sound of my voice. Tell us the police. We can see you on camera. Walk to me now. You hear that? Yep. Walk to me. I can hear you. The helicopter's got you. Right there at that first major pop of trees, you're still in the creek. Come behind you. you. Got hands on. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Go ahead and talk. All right, man. Let's try to get you up. Vehicle Hold on. Is up on you. Oh. Yeah, exactly. Give out text to the GM. All right. Hey, Albert, you take off the Here, give me your hands. There you go. There we go. Teamwork makes the creek. He was laying down in the creek. We used our FLIR system, which senses the heat from a person's body, and our helicopter was able to direct us down into the creek bed where we took him into custody. We've got uh, three people still outstanding. We've got the helicopter still circling. People that ran are calling him. Yeah. Are they? Yeah. Trying called. to get picked up? Hey, Maya. It's called. All their IDs are in here now. This is the loot that they yeah, they tried to take. Obviously, they weren't even trying to conceal it. They were just oh, yeah. doing a run out. So it's always good to get their yeah. their stuff back to them. They hit you we offered $2,700. So we ended up with the primary in custody. We know that he was the getaway driver. We still got three outstanding. The brush is so thick, we weren't able to locate the other three. We've got driver's license and ID, so this isn't done. We'll do some follow-up investigations tomorrow morning and go from there.